My beautiful souls, welcome into a daily read for Monday. I hope you're doing absolutely amazing out there. Um, as I struggle a bit this morning, let's jump right into the cards and see what we get. We're beginning with the magician. What are you trying to manifest, my friend? It feels like you are doing a really good job at staying in the present moment, but then certain factors of your life, whether it's a spirit or two, it could be energy otherwise outside of you, it could be a habit or two of yours, pushing you to bounce to the past and then to the future, but then you bring yourself back to the present moment. And so I need you to give yourself a lot of credit in regards to doing that very efficiently, but as well in regards to dealing with certain levels of BS in your life, whether it's uh, connected to intertwined with that job, could be where you're living, it could be who you're dating, it could be a friend or a family member, if not several. Um, it could be in regards to something else completely different. So apply it as you may, as you need to, but I feel like you need that reminder that you're doing an amazing job, okay? Um, but they're drawing me heavily to the um, possibilities, the infinity symbol, if you will, as I struggle once again. Um, and I feel as if that is going to be a major focus for you. You're going to feel as if spirits saying loud and clear in different ways, maybe different levels of synchronicities, uh, different types that the possibilities are endless for you. Okay, you need to remember this time and time again, not even just throughout this day, but more so moving forward. Because uh, again, I feel like certain factors of your life uh, pull you away from that uh, remembering, okay, that uh, realization even. But as well, I feel like for somebody, a tattoo, if not several, whether it's something you have yet to, um, you know, get painted on your body is the wording coming through, or maybe one you already have, it could be somebody else's. But a tattoo of importance is taking a highlight, if not two at most. Um, the chariot card beautiful energy as well. It feels like you are motivated, okay? You're driven being drawn to this reading, but that drive at times rewinding back, if you think uh, selectively um, in, in a simplistic manner, um, has uh, been stripped away from you or just not as present, okay? Doesn't mean you're not a driven and motivated individual, but it does feel like certain factors, again, have le uh, left you feeling just kind of distant from that uh, driven way of being but as well I feel like there's a, a situation in your life the spirit is not going to ruin this reading um, there's a situation in your life that is not uh, always very crystal clear to you okay it's not all black and white um, and that again is going to differ from case to case from soul to soul but I feel like you're meant to gain at least a little bit of clarity whether it's right after this uh, Monday or within it for some drawn to the reading but let's keep pulling all right, doing a flip, I feel like you're as well a bit torn, okay? Um, whether you realize that stepping into this day period or not, you're a bit torn in regards to whether or not to continue something, maybe more in regards to what to choose, uh, what to bring on. Uh, it could be uh, a, t a torn kind of feeling between something you have now and something you could choose moving forward. But we are moving on to the Six of Wands. I mean, let's hold up these three cards for a hot second and notice how beautiful um the energy is okay this imagery feeling like you need to remember how good you have it even though certain factors of your day-to-day -day life are not ideal or perfect um for somebody it's like you keep uh finding yourself focusing on lack uh you know i don't have that connection or that commitment otherwise i don't have enough money i don't have that job or the business success i desire um or maybe i don't have enough friends in my life is what i'm getting um, but I feel like you're gaining attention throughout this period regardless, and it's going to feel like you are meant to be noticed, okay? Because for, regardless of whether or not you have been noticed for winding back, you know, previous to this Monday, you're meant to either way feel throughout this uh, energy period noticed, appreciated, and honored is now what's coming through. You're going to be feeling as if there's triumphant energy within your life. Okay, you may even find uh, this time period highlights other people being uh, triumphant, victorious, you know, however you want to word it, uh, successful in one if not multiple ways. And this maybe is necessary, I feel the need to say, to take you away from overly focusing on your own situation, okay? Um, you're as well going to feel like you are being reminded of how truly strong you are as an individual because 
I, once again, I feel like certain factors in your life, uh, regardless of um, what that is or whether or not it's consistent or not, or kind of, you know, varies, is strips away that realization or the remembrance of how truly strong you are maybe even strips away in temporarily um that str uh, strong kind of feeling anyways any ways as my voice struggles the wheel card okay another beautiful strong positive energy coming through because the wheel is turning in your favor whether you want to notice it in the moment be one with it or not um things are working to your advantage <clears throat> and you need to be okay with a risk you're about to take. I have no idea what it's going to be for you, but you need to just be okay with taking a risk, whether you're typically that type of person, okay with, uh, you know, risk taking in your life or not. Um, but questioning things at this time is going to be a no go is what I'm hearing. Um, you will find that questioning things leaves you in a state of manifesting the worst. Okay. Um, as well, I feel like somebody, if not multiple people who treated you poorly in the past are going to be in the upcoming week or two gaining negative karma. Put your hands up, okay? This is the work of, I feel, um, you know, I'm hearing the circle of life. But uh, anyways, more so it's the work of spirit, okay? Putting their hands on things and making sure people learn a, a hefty lesson or two. But moving right along, I feel as if the Page of Pentacles is talking about investing, all right? Um, where do you want to put your money next? Where do you need to hold back from putting your money uh, throughout this day? But I feel like you need to as well think about the future of your career or the future of that specific job. How do you see things proceeding moving forward? Some of which onto the reading honestly are seeing things inaccurately, but others of which are seeing things pretty damn clear. And so uh, taking a step back is going to help you uh, either adjust your perspective or remember or notice for the first time that you're seeing things accurately. Again, it's going to vary from case to case. Keeping in mind, this is a general read for um, whoever is uh, guided to it. But the Three of Cups, I mean, they're all very positive energies coming to, uh, coming to be, but it feels like there is certain levels of negativity in your life. W who and what you feel distant from throughout this energy period is going to be taking a focus as well because I feel like you can't help but feel disconnected from that person or those people or that job or maybe uh, something else in your life and it, that speaks wonders, okay? Where you have been or are throughout this day feeling very silent, that's a message, okay? And I feel like it's being thought about, reflected upon maybe even noticed uh, throughout this day um, very, very clearly. Anyways, but there are reasons to celebrate. There's reasons to feel connected otherwise, but you need to be selective as to who and what gets your attention, your energy, and your resources. Um, very interesting. I don't know why they're highlighting this tattoo, and I have that exact tattoo here, if you could even see it, which I got in Ireland. In Ireland, wow. The struggle is not just because I'm tired and whatnot, it's, uh, you know, spiritual messing with. But I feel as if there's also a highlight on the fact that, uh, and I feel like this came up in yesterday's daily read for Sunday, some of which John to the reading are about to go through a spiritual uh, shifting, okay? Things shifting more so in your favor towards more protection, more guidance, and less uh, difficulty. But the lover's card, because I feel like it's a day where you are meant to feel loved, okay? You're meant to feel honored. Uh, respected once again it's a time for you where as well your choices are, are very much important okay trust your intuition because being drawn to this reading you're a very intuitive soul but you don't remember to feel it out in the moment okay or you don't remember to uh to trust what you're actually feeling accurately um maybe because uh, of spiritual guidance and uh, twists and turns otherwise but it feels like a time period for you where things are more so working out in your favor uh, than it actually feels in the moment okay or in general so remind yourself once again to wrap up this reading you're doing an amazing job all right take care